I'm Ryan from ORS Racks Direct. Here to demonstrate the Yakima Lowrider Tower with a set of Yakima round bars. The Yakima Lowrider Towers work with vehicles that have factory side rails, such as these here. And they attach around the side rail and support the crossbars. If your vehicle doesn't have any crossbars at all, they're certainly a necessity. Some vehicles do come with factory crossbars but you might choose to use these instead because of their increased load capacity and the option of putting a longer crossbar on so that you may carry more accessories. You can actually get a bike carrier on the outside of your foot if the bar is long enough where obviously on a factory system you cannot. And also with a factory crossbar system a lot of carriers require what are called mighty mounts or universal mighty mounts from Yakima to attach the carrier to the factory crossbar where on the standard round bar you don't need an accessory I'm sorry you don't need a, a an adapter for that application they'll go right onto those round bars I want to show you how easily these attach basically drop the foot onto the side rail you crank this down and as I'm doing that there's a clamp on the inside you can't really see it because of this rubber sleeve here, a rubber gasket, um, but it's, it's actually clamping around the side rail. And it can open up really wide and it can also, you know, close quite narrow. So it's very universal for most side rails. Some vehicles, however, require the use of what's called the Lowrider Max or the Easy Rider Tower. Your side rails might have a shape that doesn't quite work with this design, so that's an alternative for you. So make sure you check the fit guide to determine which lowrider tower you need. Don't assume if you see side rails that the lowrider is the one for you is what I'm trying to say. Once you've got that clamp down nice and snug, you lock it down into place and you're ready to rock and roll. You might notice there aren't any end caps on these bars. Uh, the round bars come, or actually I should say the foot packs come with end caps for your bars that look like this and they pop right in there. The Yakima gives you a few options for end caps to kind of customize the look of your rack system. And there they are. The Livestrong end cap and the Chrome Skull end cap, which is my personal favorite. And they basically pop on just like the regular end caps do. There's a Livestrong cap there. And there's the Chrome Skull end cap. So it's kind of cool you can customize, and obviously you would pound those in so they're flush with the end of the bar, but it kind of gives you an idea of what it looks like on there. <laughs> Pretty cool, I think. And those will work with, you know, as long as you've got round bars on your vehicle, whether it's the low rider tower, or the Q tower, or the control tower, these end caps will fit right in there perfectly well. So, once you've... Uh, got these towers mounted to your side rails, it's certainly a good idea to think about getting some locks. Um, the lock cores integrate right into this little um, lock cylinder here and you'll need four locks to lock the rack tower down to your, to your side rails. If you're buying carriers as well, you might want more lock cores, that way you only need to use one key. Uh, these can come off, as you see, pretty easily, just as easily as they go on, so it's a good idea to invest in some locks to secure this all down to your, to your vehicle. So once again, Yakima Lowrider Towers, and some very cool skull end caps. Thanks for watching.